Hey, it is me, Super Sparrow 323, and I am here with Dapcom. Yes, I said that right. <laughs> I knew it. Perfect timing as always. Yes. So we are here again, going to fight another Colossi. Now, uh, my friend who tells me all about this game basically told me how to get there because he said at the rate of my traveling and how bad I am with getting anywhere. It would take me a freaking hour to get there if I didn't know where I was going. So, yeah, he said you had to go through a bunch of canyons, and you'd end up on the, I think he said, northwest side of the map. There you go! What? There you go! Oh. So, yeah, uh, the top left part of the screen. Should we shoot it like we did that lizard last time? I already tried. Yeah, how'd that work out? Um, nothing happened. I would not walk across this thing. It got darker. What? It got darker! No, not really. It's like right after you said that, the entire screen started getting dark. Wow, your eyesight is worse than I thought. So yeah, he said go through a bunch of canyons and ravines and shit. And basically he said we're going into this like ruined city. And what you get, like, you'll know you're go you've, like, pretty much gotten there when you hit, uh, these, like, these row of two, like, there's a long row of two of, like, pillars. And then there's, like, a cave and a pool of water where you gotta leave that grow. So, yeah. Mm. Yeah! This friend of yours is very informed. Where did he get his information from himself? Yeah. He's a ridiculously good at this game. Oh, oh, really? Yeah. Nice. Yeah, he's beat this game several times. Yeah, this game is known for its clunky horses and <laughs> amazingness. Yeah. It, like, I just want to kind of, like, again, say that like, this game really is amazing. And the fact that it came out in the PS2 era and it's so sort of out there. Like, I mean, think about it. Like, there's not even any games really like this today. There's... 16 enemies total in this game, a lot of travel, and just a lot of atmosphere. Not really much, uh, script. Yeah, I mean, like, and there's no, like, there's a lot of stuff left up to interpretation, like, who is Wander, and who is, uh, Mono, who's, uh, his girlfriend. Yeah. See, the screen got dark. It was just like that time. Well, because we just went wa walked into a fucking canyon. What do you expect? More light because I can't yeah. see anything. I know, right? You can't fucking. I can't. I can barely see where the hell I'm going. It's pretty yeah. dark in here. What? Yeah. yeah. Uh. Yeah, yeah. That's one thing I kind of don't like about the sword. It makes sense. Like you can't use it if you're not in the sunlight. But at the same time, it's kind of like, come on. This thing's like a, a weapon flashlight, yeah. sort of. <laughs> yeah, except flashlights are usually used when there's no light. Yeah. So, your logic is invalid. My logic is invalid. Your logic's invalid. Your logic is invalid! Yeah, nah, nah, nah. End of discussion. Now, uh, he said you want to constantly check the map just to make sure you're going the right way. Mm. He said you want to take, like, basically take the passage that will let you go up top left the yeah. most. God, it's like the trees from Slender. <laughs> Except without leaves. Yeah. You know how those trees look like, right? Yeah. yeah, they're kind of the same tree over and over again. Yeah, yeah. it's just like this. If you say so. I do say so. Yeah. Yeah. Pillar! Yes! The pillars. Uh, uh, okay. I don't know uh, what... Um... Oh shit, I just forgot the name of that. Name of what? That, that, where that freaking song is from. Yeah. The game show. Jeopardy. Yes. I don't know what Jeopardy does with killing giant monsters, but... Yeah, it's probably to do with killing giant monsters. If you say so. Yeah, I do say so. Yeah. That's the second time we did that. 
Exactly. Uh, tunnels. Great. Yeah, uh, just like last time. Yeah. Well, at least it's, yeah. I can see in here. Sort of. And looks like this is where we and our ghost around his feet. Aggro. <laughs> yeah, so this is the fastest way to swim, is just dive under the fucking water and use your breath and your stamina. Because this yeah, uh, god, this guy swims so slowly. I I don't think so. I think he swims swims like normal. Yeah, I know, but normal is pretty much slowly. <laughs> yeah. Let's play hopscotch in the water, guys! <laughs> How do you even jump like that out of the water? Pads. Like he clear he almost clears his entire body out of the water. Well, you can do that in the pool. I mean you swim up, you know, you can Well out no, of the water. like he doesn't bounce off the bottom or anything. He just jumps straight out of the water. Yeah. And by the way, for a guy who can freaking keep his balance on giant flying monsters and keep a grip on like two hundred foot tall creatures freaking flailing around he really doesn't have that very good balance when it comes to walking he can't really run that well either i mean yeah that's what i'm saying like he's constantly like yeah, yeah. whoa mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. yeah i like it yes i like it a lot yes you do we should live here yeah Never... Maybe, ne maybe next time on the next episode. This is Super Sparrow 33 with Defcon signing off. If you like this video, Spartan kick that like button in the face and subscribe for more awesome content. See you guys next time. I would now stay.